Today we're using this uh, block tester. It tests if uh, an engine has a, uh, a head gasket or not. Um, instructions are simple. Uh, basically, this piece is off. All you have to do the the liquid you pour inside this to this mark fluid level, and then you place this piece. The plunger on top and the way you use it is you do this but with the car cold not warm we're going to do is open the hood we're working on this 2003 uh, Chevy S10 I was told it has a uh, Head gasket. So, radiator, radiator cap. On the radiator. Radiator cap. It looked to me like it had a leak here somewhere from the radiator. I ran it the other day for like a couple of hours. I didn't see any leak or any overheat. Okay, it was a little bit low on antifreeze and I put some. What we need to do is we need to empty uh, the antifreeze for about uh, two inches, they say, two inches lower than the level of the radiator. So when you use this, uh, you just suck in air, you don't be sucking the uh, antifreeze from the radiator that's the purpose why you need to lower it a little bit um, let me do that and I'll get back now we have to start the, the vehicle let it warm up until uh, normal temperature make sure to not let it overheat if there is any and we'll come back with this on the radiator and if uh, the air mixture with this uh, uh, fluid, uh, if, if it turn color to either green or yellow, that means it's no good. It has the fumes from the uh, antifreeze. Uh, there is some, uh, uh, you know, oil mixture with the with the antifreeze. But if it stays blue or close to it, that means uh, the car is good. It doesn't have any. Uh, any freeze uh, issue, I mean, uh, head gasket issue. So, right now we're at normal temperature. I pulled some antifreeze. So it, it failed, I failed uh, because the way this is set up sideways every time I empty some the antifreeze keep keep getting to the to the bottom of of the tool and gets to the uh, you know inside so what I'm going to do I'm going to do it at the the coolant reservoir right here 
I just have to put some more fluid. I empty the, the stuff that I used before. I'm gonna get some more uh, more of the fluid here and do the test again. Okay, so put more here. Put this back. I had doubts the other day because I ran it for like an hour and it didn't hold the heat. And I have this kit at home, I haven't used it, I bought it recently. So I said, okay, let me just make sure. They said, they said the car overheats, head gasket, that's what they said. And I see some signs of know overheating from the radiator from the cab so that's why I wanted to make sure but to me so far everything is good I don't see no color right here well so far I uh, I did probably 20 squeezes and that color is not changing at all even when I had it here it didn't change until uh, it changed to green because of the uh, anything got into it but uh, so far, I don't think this has a, uh, a head present. I will uh, check the shaking issue later, probably tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe uh, if you want to see more videos. And also hit the, uh, the notification button, the bell button, to get notifications about more videos. Thank you so much.